from the Daniel Lynch Gymnasium in Brooklyn Heights, Brooklyn, USA. This is St. Francis Terriers basketball on the Terrier Sports Network, powered by NEC Front Row, as today, St. Francis of Brooklyn hosts Mount St. Mary's in an NEC conference matchup. And defensively, they're not stopping it well. Sean Kui around the screen by a Poku. There's Nana down low, and he slams it down for the first two points of the game. Had a nice offensive play off an inbound situation under their basket, and then come back, all right, and don't get a stop. You don't want to trade baskets after that nice offensive play. It's good that they just came back here now and threw a blow. Well, the Terriers have played nine players each game so far this season. John Quee, the open three, it's in and out, but there's Malik Jefferson with the rebound and he puts it home to give them out a five point advantage. Well, another offensive rebound for the hungry Mountaineers on the glass. And the Terrier is gonna have to do something about that. Really put a body on him. Hawkins from mid range gets the friendly roll. 17-14 now. Chauncey has seven. What do you call that, Mark? The Remsen roll? Remsen street roll? Oops. It's Chauncey around the Vuk screen. Robbie for three. Good. Higgins gives the Terriers their first lead of the year. Andre Thomas making his Mountaineers debut today. Down low for Opoku. It was knocked away. Higgins ahead of the field, and he lays it in. Terriers are back on top on the shot clock. Off him for Chan Kui. Five to shoot for Damian. Puts it up from way downtown and he nails it. First two points of the half, Terriers trail by six. And that's, that's important for him to get him going, Mark. His first two points of the day. That's off the back iron. McLean comes up with the rebound. Unique with the rebounding prowess. Drives in on Jefferson and Unique uses the glass to make it a four point game. Yeah, I was obstructed by the two bodies. But Guy Pagano saw it. Chong Kui from downtown rattles it home. And he's got his third triple of the game. He did that to end the first half. And you can see how he really, he's savvy. He strategically sets up his feet to get that shot. Yeah, he's made his last two. Team high 13 points. And he's given the Mountaineers Another lead, McLean for Yaya. Evans puts that one in from downtown. We're tied again. Carrier cutouts too. Here's Atson from downtown. He bangs Whoa. it off the window. Hey, Travis Atson, you got to call that. 525 and the bank's open in Brooklyn. Chances and giving them possessions to go down and score. McLean shakes off Miller. Puts it up and in, off the window again for McLean. He's got 13. Nice job using the glass on that. And the Mounties push it up. Reeves might have traveled, no call. Pass back for Lefew. This will be a backcourt, but no, Hawkins stole it away to Mowencat. That's good. The Terriers hit 70. They lead by 15. Final inbound from Reeves to Lefew, and that is all she wrote, my friends. St. Francis Brooklyn rings in the new year, albeit a few days late. With a 70 to 55 win, they improved to three and three on the season, three and two in the NEC, and an even 500, two and two here at the Lynch.